Welcome to WP Forms, the best WordPress contact form plugin on the market. In this video, I'm going to show you how to embed a contact form on your site in three different but easy ways. So let's jump right in. Let's go over the first method, starting off in the form builder. Once your form has been created, click on the embed button on the top right corner of the page. A pop-up will appear on screen and you'll be able to choose to either add the form to an existing page or create an entirely new page on your site to add the form to. If you select Create New Page, you'll then be asked to write in a name for the page. Once you've added the name, click on the Let's Go button. Both embed options will take you to the Gutenberg block editor. Your form should now be displayed in the editor itself. When you're ready, click on either the blue Publish or Update button in the top right corner. What the button says will depend on whether or not you're adding the form to an existing page or a brand new page. If it says publish, an extra message will appear asking if you're sure you want to publish your page and to double check all of your settings before doing so. When you're done, click the publish button again. Let's move on to our second method, which is adding the form directly into the WordPress block editor. Starting off in the Gutenberg editor, you'll notice that there are two plus icons, one in the top left corner of the page and one somewhere in the middle of the editor itself. Clicking either one will allow you to search for a block to add to your page. In our case, we're going to look for the WP Forms block. You can either scroll through the available blocks or use the search bar and type WP Forms to find it. Once you do, click on it to add it to your page. The block will then display a drop down. Click on it and select the form you'd like to embed on your page. Once you've found it and selected it, click on either the Publish or Update button on the top right corner of the builder and you're all set. Alternatively, you can skip clicking the plus button altogether and instead click directly on the page and type forward slash WP Forms and select it when it appears. Then repeat the form selection process we just went through. Now let's move on to our final method, using shortcode. Shortcode is just a tiny code snippet you can insert in your posts, pages, widgets, and more to either display content or perform a function. Let's start off in our WordPress dashboard. On the left menu, go to WP Forms and then All Forms. In the Forms Overview table, you should see a column called Shortcode. If you don't see it, click on the gear icon on the top right corner of the table and check the Shortcode box. This should make the Shortcode column appear if it's not currently displayed. Find the form you want to embed on your page and copy the Shortcode in its respective row. Be sure to include the brackets and not just the text inside. Next, head over to the Pages menu and either select an existing page or choose the Add New Page option. Once you're back in the Gutenberg block editor, click on the page and type in forward slash shortcode and select the shortcode block when it appears. Paste the shortcode you just copied into the provided text field and you can click either Publish or Update when you're ready. Or, even easier, you can simply click on the empty page and paste the shortcode directly onto it and then click either Publish or Update on the top right corner. And that's all there is to it. You now know how to embed a contact form on your WordPress site in three easy ways. If you have any questions or concerns, please visit wpforms.com and check out our documentation page, where you can find step-by-step -step written guides for all of our features, add-ons, and more. You can also join our WP Forms VIP Circle group on Facebook to learn even more tips and tricks, as well as be part of the growing WP Forms community. If you need any extra technical help, please visit our contact page and reach out to our support team.